Hello to all my friends out there. And so for the past, I don't know, it's been a while, I've been making stuff on the stove, you know, so I don't run out of um, food. And one of the things you don't want to run out of is milk. And so, you know, I bought some, uh, I was shopping, and I think for this, the best way to go uh, is Walmart. And the other thing you don't want to run out of is bread. So, um, you know, I've been, I bought this at Dollar Tree, no, 99 cent only for a dollar, and I made bread on a skillet. And I bought the flour 10 pounds at a... Uh, 99 cent only so uh one way you could make sure let's see oh this one looks good is not to run out of bread is to make some nice yummy pancakes but pancakes are kind of like um are kind of like cornbread you have to have eggs and milk so in your stockpile you know these are easy to run out of so what I bought, and I didn't know where to find these. I should have known. I found this at Walmart. And um, it's really, really easy to uh, use. So I just want to treat my pancakes like uh, two pieces of bread. Uh, and this was really easy to convert into, uh, and these are three pieces of bacon. And I bought the bacon at uh, 99 cent only. I'll show you in case you didn't see the last video. I bought two of these and I cut them in half and I keep one in the refrigerator and I I freeze uh, three and so you know that way you know uh, I did a video and I'll tell you what they are after look at them okay and this is just two eggs that I just scrambled you know on top of the the stove and then I keep uh, margarine One in the refrigerator. Oh, you don't want to run out of margarine. Uh, but, you know, if you have oil, it'll be okay. Uh, these pancakes uh, smell really good. Now, ooh, I bought the oil at Dollar Tree, but normally I will stockpile shortening. And so you might be thinking, well, you know, aren't you afraid you're going to get... Uh, you're going to get high cholesterol and die? Uh, you know what I don't want? Malnutrition. All right. You want milk, bread, cornbread. I made half a batch. Eggs. You don't want to run out of eggs. Okay, I have my uh, I have my refrigerator really cold, so my syrup got kind of thick and gluey, but I'm sure it'll be fine. So you know, if you don't have syrup, you know you can run out of syrup. God forbid it can happen. That's why in your stockpile you have jam and honey. Out of all, the best one to be would start would be honey. And then, I guess about a month ago, one of the women, and I really appreciate this comment, and thank you very much, suggested chipotle and lime. But, uh, so okay, I didn't find the powdered form yet, but I found the salsa, the chipotle salsa, and I really, really like it. I love it. You know, so as not to be eating the same thing over and over and over. Now let me show you something because I forgot to take it out. Okay, let me see what kind it is. Peach tea. I save everything and eventually I eat or drink it. Okay, so milk, bread, eggs, and then the other thing is cheese. 
I bought these at Dollar Tree and and these are pretty good. I I did a video and I used this on my burritos. Uh, I use them on my salads. You don't want to run out of cheese. Also, if you have this and you know it's the end of the month and you run out of bread, well you can just have some pasta. You know what I found? Um, I found that um, that pasta with half cheese, half meat was really good. Okay, so say you don't have any bacon. Well, if you stockpile ham, you could cut your ham in little pieces and put it in your egg. All right, now let me see if I can find the meals because a lot of people, uh, I seem to be getting quite a few, uh, quite a few new followers. That's a good situation. I'm glad you guys met me if you just met me. And if you're kind of broke, uh, stick it out for a while. You know, I realize I can be irritating. Uh, that makeup tutorial was terrible, but, you know, it can help, you know, just try to figure out what am I saying here. All right, I'm looking for the seven dinners. I have a lot of notes. I have to write down everything. I forget everything. I might have to give up and do it in the next video if I don't find it pretty soon. Hmm. I have, okay, here it is. Hot dogs, hamburgers, spaghetti, tacos, chicken. Uh, next I want to make some, um, some um, dry rub chicken again. That's very delicious. Beans one night. Uh, I like the 16 beans and some kind of breakfast. That would be this. Okay, now let me let me taste these. Um, you know, um, this is the first one I made and I had never used this. And you know, I used evaporated milk. So the second one, I added a little flour. But you know, um, when you make stuff from uh, homemade, I couldn't find my knife. Oh, it's there. You make stuff from homemade, it's always good. You can eat it the next day. All right, now let me show you. This is my homemade pancakes. I don't know why my light is so rotten. I want to show you the whole entire plate. Try this one. Let me try it now, and I will tell you. If I hate it, I'll tell you. It's good, you know. Um, don't even go there. Don't run out of eggs. Um, I'm not sure about scrambling these. I think it's mostly for baking. But, you know, if you were out of, pretty much out of food and all you had was uh, eggs and some cheese and some bread, I think you could get by on that. Okay, you guys, I will be back tonight. I will make a little something out of my uh, turkey burger. Okay, God bless you all.